Lebton Quay up here. We're just going to head up Lebton Quay. It's only a block or two back to Parliament. So we're going to do a walk through the village, see what's new today, and see if we can find any interesting, any interesting stuff. I'm just going to pull my stabiliser out of the tripod just a moment. There we go. It's a bit easier to carry that way. No, I believe they have not looked at the video. Um, I'm not 100% sure on that though, so please don't take that as gospel. Uh, but he was in there, in and out so fast, I doubt there was any time to watch or analyse the footage. Police presence out outside uh, Parliament here on the corner of Whitmore Street and Lambton Quay. Oh yes, Genevieve, thank you so much for reminding me about that kids' tree house. I really want to go and see it and see how that's pro uh, progressed because that looked really cool when the guy was uh, starting to build it yesterday. We caught that on the live stream. this sign before it says we are people here for the people we are under no banner of ulterior motives our kaupapa is of aroha and pure intent for our children's future who are sorry who are we if we don't ask questions when it clearly doesn't make any sense nothing adds up if you have nothing to hide there would be transparency where is the respect of a healthy debate why won't you talk to the people of Aotearoa? Ask yourself, is the domino effect on all realms for humanity worth it? Hmm. Oh wow, so if you guys look up here, I can see the tree house from here, up in the tree there. So I'm just going to go check it out, see how it's going. been inside Parliament grounds as yet today so let's discover everything together. Kia ora. Is this a place for free range children or what? Oh, it looks like this is the compost couch, compost area. Very cool. But yeah, look at that. Got some steps up there for the tamaraki.
You know what? I'm I'm a little bit tempted to climb up there, but uh, yeah, no, I'm not going to. Lauren, Parliament needs a hangi put. Hard out, Cuddy. Some artwork here. And here's our the beginning of our community garden, which we've we've visited a few times now. But we've got all sorts of things in here, and we also <laughs> I've heard word that we have a neighbourhood bunny rabbit who seems to be getting into the kai a little bit. Oh, well, this is new. There's something really tiny growing underneath this little jar here. Not sure what that is, but it's a little cutie. I'll leave that there. Yellow cherry guava. Here it says check out our other veggie garden too. So we saw that yesterday and that was up behind the rose gardens. Yeah. Oh hemp! Queen, thank you so much. Yes, I remember there was actually a sign here uh, asking for anyone who might have a hemp plant. So yes, I think you're right. It must be hemp. You can see our little rabbit has been into those lettuces down there. By oh, golly. Uh, heaps of mescaline, chives, basil, uh, cucumber, zucchini, peas, beans, tomato plants, uh, cabbage, broccoli, everything. Parsley, coriander, uh, and of course our, <laughs> our scarecrow. Uh, Uh, the beehive here has been dubbed the free hive and this is the garden. May it nourish our mind, body and souls. We've got seeds here, we've got all sorts of plants and pots and things. Uh, I'm not sure if something might be planted in those trays. Oh, we've got some thrive, we've got some power fertilizer. Yeah, pretty cool. Let's go see what's happening up on our love wall. Oh, it looks like the uh, it looks like the basketball hoop has suffered a bit with the wind last night. Either that or it's been taken down just to prevent it knocking over with the wind. It just hasn't been set up yet. There's our uh, our Tanifa friend up there with his body spelling out the words kotahitanga, the word, sorry. It looks like we've got a, I think that's another tanifa there, and another one, and even yet another one. My favourites, real lies, real lies, real lies. <gasps> and here is the girl we met yesterday who has been doing all these amazing pictures. So she did a uh, William Wallace there, we've got Gandhi, we've got uh, Nelson Mandela, we've got Bob Marley, <laughs> we've got Yoda up there now. Yoda's new. And who are you drawing at the moment, babe? Harriet Tubman. Sorry? Harriet Tubman. Tubman? No, who is she? Oh, wow. Okay. Beautiful. Yeah. Awesome. Well done. And um, are you going to keep going after her? Have you? For example. Oh, nice. 
Yes, it's okay. No worries. Did you manage to get a arty page up yet? Yes, I did. I right. Down there. Oh, and awesome. Down there. Where is it? Sorry? It's down the book. Oh, follow jazz. me at Made by Jazz. Yeah. And if anyone has any Beautiful. So when we came by and met you yesterday, you didn't have a page up there uh, yet. Is that on uh, Instagram or Facebook? Instagram. Instagram. Okay, so at Made underscore by Jazz. Uh, if you guys want to see some more of her art and what she's doing and maybe send her some suggestions on what should go up on the wall next. Thank you so much for your mahi. Beautiful. Okay. Uh, yep, we will head around to Papahone's tent, guys. We'll just uh, check out what's going on here and then we'll head down over to Papahone. Ah. Uh, I can see there's a there's a flag just up here. It's backwards, so it's obviously aimed at the police. But it says "Come for a kappa." What does it say at the bottom? Let's let's talk. Yeah, it says "Come for a kappa." Let's talk. <laughs> Is that aimed at the police or aimed at the MPs of Parliament? Aimed at Jacinda? Not sure. Uh, no, it's. Uh, Thank you, um, someone just shared the link at, uh, at Made by Jazz. Uh, it's actually Made by Jazz, so Jazz is J-A-S, not J-A-Z. Made underscore by Jazz, J-A-S. Oh, actually, I'm not going to go to the main stage right now because I can see there's nothing happening up there. Nobody's on stage, so we'll just head back down here. We'll go past the Hare Krishna tent and then over to Papahone's tent. Hulk <laughs> smash. Yeah, <laughs> that'd be a good idea. Okay, so you can please... Excuse me. Where's this media team forward from, do you know? This one's here. Yeah. I don't know, they're, they're pro... They're pro what we're doing here. That's why we're actually interviewing them. She's, That's she's, media she's just showing she's how it's affected her. So she's showing awesome. how it's affected people's lives. That's the mother yeah, of this. I've just got heaps of people on my streams that ask for other live streams to follow. So I just wanted to let my people know if she's streaming. You don't, you don't know. I don't know. No? Yeah. Like, that's okay. You it looks like she's busy at the moment, so I'll leave her alone. Okay, yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Okay. Sorry guys, I was trying to get you another handle to another live stream for you guys to keep up with things here, but um, she's busy interviewing someone else at the moment. This is the whole tent. Thank you so much. Uh, they offer, so they have qualified people in here who have either been mandated out of their work or they have just come here to offer their services in support of what we're doing. Uh, so they offer midi midi massage, bowen, energy work, karakia, osteopath, reiki and chiropractic work. Uh, so if you're having any trouble and you're on site, come down here. Looks like we've got a wee bit of a line just waiting for treatment here. Uh, and over here we've got the Hare Krishna tent again. Very popular with their meals. Uh, there's a lot of vegetarian and vegan kai that comes here. Looks, those are our meal times for today. Something's missing from this picture. Fine. Where's your flag? Oh, you're just still wearing the t-shirt. <laughs> no, 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 you're all good, you're all good. Oh, <laughs> this, is our, this is our favourite hug guy who gives the best medicinal hugs. <laughs> oh. I missed that, sorry, I'm hard of hearing. Oh, and it, yeah, you're doing an amazing job. Thank you so much. Hey, um, any chance you would be keen to answer some questions? No, That's okay. Have your kai. Thank you, my friend. Okay, yep, here's Papa Hunya's tent. Tanya, Amanda Wilson filming. Ah, oh, thank you for the heads up, if anyone wants to follow that up. Uh, yep, it looks like Papa Hunya's tent is indeed closed at the moment. They've pulled everything out of the tent. Uh, and it looks like they are giving it a good clean out. So the main kitchen tent did that uh, last week. They shut down for the day and just had a really big clean out. 
Papua Hone's tent uh, sort of took a lot of the uh, extra people who were here for lunch and dinner that day and I guess the main tent are going to be doing the same thing for Papua Hone at the moment while uh, they're busy cleaning up and stuff. There's still a sign up here at Papua Hone's tent saying more help required so if you're here or you can spare just a couple of hours please come down and volunteer your time. They've got the pātaka over there for whānau to help themselves if they're in need to any uh, food they've got donated there which is awesome and this is their kai prep area so they've got all those bags of potatoes and man look at all those avocados it's probably a hundred dollars worth of avocados right there all those uh, onions and things lemons down there they've been making a lot of raw fish uh, a lot of stews mac and cheese for the kids lots of fresh fruit and veggies uh, they've even been doing steam hangi over there and uh, they've bought, some of the boys have been going out diving and so they've come back with um, like crayfish and pawa. There's, there was a cream pawa there one day. It was bloody awesome. <laughs> Kia ora, how's it going? How's all the tattoos going? Yeah, going good. A little behind. Yeah. Had, a, had to do a few things yesterday. So. Got three more to do from yesterday, just catch myself back up. Carpi, awesome. Good to see you back, my friend. <laughs> How's it going, Fire? Right, we're making up the mini kitchen today. Hey, yes, this is a new development. So this is a Hara Kiki tent where Fire here has been teaching other people how to weave. And uh, this is new, this little setup. So you've got an element there for cooking. You've got electricity. It's coming from a generator, obviously. And you've got some clay yeah, here. Breather, so we're, you know, we're happy to cook our own as well. Yeah, for sure. Awesome. Yeah, anyone who can cook for themselves here is definitely appreciated. The food tents are all asking people to please, if they can, bring your own cutlery, bring your own plates, bring your own mugs, uh, knives and forks and things, just to decrease the amount of waste that's been generated here. Although the majority of these paper plates and things have all been recyclable, which is great. Yes, guys, for those who don't know, Clay Drummond is back. Uh, so Clay Drummond is a good friend of mine. He um, arrived back uh, yesterday, I believe, and he is straight back into the live streaming as of this morning. So if you want uh, access to another live streamer, please look up Clay Drummond. The children's area? Oh my gosh. I can smell so much popcorn right now. Oh, and we've got the tin foil today, I believe. Um, let me just go and double check details. I'll put the camera down. We don't need to put cameras on people's faces all the time. Hi, beautiful. I'm live streaming just so you know, but the camera's pointing down at the moment. Um, is this for the tin foil hat parade thing? Yeah, this one is. Yeah. When is that happening again? Is it two o'clock? Two. And whereabouts? At the main stage, okay. We're, we're gonna, yeah, yeah, two o'clock. Awesome. Um, I'm live streaming to a page on Facebook called Zeb Jackson Live. I've been here for the last 18 days streaming every day. Um, I don't like throwing cameras directly in kids' faces, but you, your mum, are you mum? No. Do you know these children? Well, um, can I just get. Oh, I was just looking at the tinfoil things that they've made and they look rather beautiful, but I'd rather have parental permission yeah. before I put them on camera. They are um, going to be up on the main stage. Awesome. So public, so yes, it is public on the main stage. video on the main stage. But here's, uh, here's one of the tinfoil. Honey, I will be up there live streaming the entire parade, okay? That's a cool hat. Who, whose is this one? Mine. Yours? Hi, Cuddy. <laughs> hey, is that your crown? Apparently so. Very cool. All right, we'll leave you guys to it. Thank you we'll so much. Yeah. Yep, you will. <laughs> so that'll be cool to see um, two o'clock today, the uh, tinfoil hat parade. So what started off as a little bit of a piss take and a giggle within the protest here, people wearing tinfoil hats, you know, because we've been told by trolls that we, you know, we're from fringe groups and, and all sorts of things. So a few people started wearing tinfoil hats as a joke. Uh, and um, I have spoken to one or two people who 
I then found it turned to a more serious reason, which was to um, prevent the EMF uh, getting through or something. I'm sorry, I don't know a lot about the EMF, but um, that, that was the reasoning they gave when we spoke to them live. But then you got to So this is the main stage. Hey, man. <laughs> So we've got some t-shirts and things up there. Guys, I'm going to have to put uh, my camera down for just a second. It's getting a little bit hot here. It was quite it was quite uh, overcast and quite cold this morning when I left. And now it's definitely heating up. So just excuse me while I just uh, sort my jersey out. And we will leave you just facing this way. One moment. prevent pausing the live stream I will uh, otherwise I'll have to pause it while I go to the toilet sorry <laughs> and plumbers here have plumbed directly into the main sewer line under the road. They've also plumbed directly into the main water line beneath Wellington as well. So that we have real flushing toilets and we no longer have to rely. Oh my god you guys. Oh my god. <laughs> I've just seen I've just seen a new sign on the side of the toilet block that says the pea hive. Welcome to the pea hive. <laughs> This just gets better and better. <sighs> Looks like we've got a wee bit of a line here. We'll just wait in line. Thank you so much. 
Cheers for the backup camera people here. Kids over here playing happily in the trampoline that's now on site. They have a sign on there that says 13 and under only. And uh, we've got a mama over there keeping keeping our little tiger bears in line. So well done mama. Yeah, uh, are you alright on camera? I'm facing down at the moment. Yes, 
so I'm sure people would like to know who I'm talking to. Uh, yeah, so uh, this is just a Kaiser Bay bus, Gimbal. <laughs> hey, it, it's all been donated by the people back at home. When I turned up here, I only had my phone. So, yeah, it's been amazing. But cool, thank you so much. So, sorry, your name was? Jacob, and you're working with Chantel Baker. Nice to meet you, my friend. Thank you. <laughs> Right, we've got the coffee cart here. Uh, again, they're saying please bring your own cups if you can, or reuse the cups that you're given throughout the day. Main food tent over here. It uh, looks like we're in between our breakfast and lunch. Are you guys okay on camera? Yeah, all good, mean. So, um, my name's Zeb Jackson. I stream, I stream to a page called Zeb Jackson Live. That's Zeb, Zeb as in zebra. Yeah, <laughs> and I come around every day and just check out all the tents. Yeah, yeah. So we've obviously got some snacks out here at the moment because we're in between breakfast and lunch. Beautiful. So it's, it's quite a, a not a Congo line. What am I thinking of? Uh, a zebra line. A zebra line. <laughs> like a zebra crossing. All formal and well organised and straight through. What's on the menu for lunch today? <laughs> not sure. Lucky draw, can't oh, wait. <laughs> yeah, and, and they've already been buttered, I assume. Yeah, so many people have been helping, it's so cold. Yeah, um, how long have you guys been helping out here at the food tent? Uh, oh, oh, yes. <laughs> Beautiful. Thank you so much for helping out. I'm sure everyone appreciates it. Well done, you guys. <laughs> Excuse me. Got our outdoor dining area, no vaccine pass required. <laughs> uh, over here we've got free dog food and we've got a big container full of bagels that are free. Oh, this is new. So over here we've got, what is that? Plum jam. What's that? Pears, it says. Pear. Here we've got Dutch style apple sauce. More plum jam. Thank you to whoever donated these. Very cool. Got some kummel kummel in there, some more dog food. It's just fill a bag, help yourself. There's plenty of dogs here. And uh, there's all the bags, help yourself to a bag. Uh, in here is for donations only. And we'll have a quick look. Uh, there we go. We can see them all prepping over there, buttering more bread. There you go. Awesome. Uh, so this is a shelf that says going to HQ. Uh, as you guys might be aware, there is a warehouse off-site somewhere, I believe. I don't know its exact location, but it's off-site and uh, a lot of the donations are going there and they are being brought in as needed. So this is a medical treatment unit. Uh, it was over here in the back of a medical treatment truck, but they've shifted it here with a few um, with a few tents. And I can see a sign there that says no photography, so I'm going to be respectful of that and just shift back over here. Uh, but the medical treatment unit has a whole lot of professionals that are medically trained like uh, paramedics, uh, nurses, doctors, uh, counsellors, physiotherapists, things like that. And they've either been mandated out of work and they've come to offer services or they're still working and uh, they just come here when and as they can to offer support to all the people here. So that's really cool. It's awesome to have them behind us. There is a unit here just full of jerry cans. So as you know, we've got so many generators running all the time uh, that we, we go through petrol quite fast. So if you know anyone coming through, if anybody's able to bring a jerry can or come down here and refill some of the jerry cans, I'm sure it would be really appreciated. Okay, so we won't go up there again. We've just come from there. We'll go down this way a bit, we'll go down to the bus station and see what's going on down there. I, I've seen, I saw those stairs yesterday and I'm still not 100% sure what those stairs might be for, those steps that have been built. Um, I'll see if these guys on the other side here know. Kia ora! Hello. It's me here, Claire. How are you doing? Hey, 
Yeah. I'm live streaming just so you guys know. You guys are right on camera? Yeah, I'm just wondering if you guys know what the steps behind you are for. So the steps behind us? Yeah. I saw them yesterday, I just didn't know what they were for. Which is okay. Who's that? Uh, the person that's coming into here. Anybody? Oh, okay. Does that start out here on the street or does that start back there? Ah. Yeah. And then on the other side there's only you can see the um, boulder. Yeah. That's another one. one up here, one on that street. Yeah. Yeah, we've seen all the blockades, yeah. So um the stairs are just to step up on <laughs> and pass your message. <laughs> Everyone's doing what they should be doing. Oh, I see, because there's, there's a bit of a downward slope down there. Down, you know, because we're not down there, we have the police down there then. So, yeah. Yeah. Um, but yeah, pretty much, so we figured that's what that was for. Cool, we'll go with that for yeah. now. <laughs> we're, we're, we're <laughs> Thank you so much. Hey, I'm streaming to a page on Facebook called Zeb Jackson Live. I've been here for the last 18 days filming. So yeah, Zeb Jackson Live. I think I did. Yes, you were harmonising. That's right. It was really cool. Thank you. Yeah, footage Zeb Jackson live. Yeah, Zeb Jackson live. Kia ora, Kari. Have a great day. Okay, so let's head down this way a bit. See what the latest goss is. There's the Wellington High Court, just there. I have not seen anyone apart from security coming in and out of those doors, so I believe it has been shut. <laughs> Cara. You're funny, babe. Oh, hey, Angel. Um, uh, we've only really got here not that long ago. We're just walking around, checking out what's new around the place. Uh, we did go down to uh, the district court in Wellington this morning just to support uh, people like Honolulu Phil who were there for, uh, uh, to face up to some charges for the police. Uh, it looks like everything at the courthouse went well. Uh, it looks like, or it sounds like everybody has been bailed until the 21st of April so that's when they'll reappear against those charges. You can see we've got some new arrivals here. It's always cool to see um, new people uh, arriving, essentially arriving home. You can always spot them because they're carrying around tents and rather large backpacks. streaming, I've got the camera facing down at the What's moment. Name? My name is Zeb, I'm streaming oh, for a page. Been you. You've been following me? Oh, thank you so much, you guys. Um, is there any chance I can throw you on camera and ask you a few questions? No worries if not, it's okay. No, that's okay, that's all right. Welcome, you guys, it's so good to have you here. Oh, you're so welcome, my friend. You guys have a great day. Voices? Oh, no, no, I do voices as well, yeah. 
Yeah. Yeah. yeah, if you want to answer some questions just yeah. with the camera yeah. facing down. Yeah, sure. Or actually, I will even, so that you guys at home have got something better to look at, I'll just turn the camera around so it's facing me. So there we go, camera's just facing me. It might look like it's pointed at you guys, but it's it's just me on camera here. I've just got a migraine on the boat, so I'm a little bit... Oh, no worries. Um, Simon, nice to meet you, my friend. So you guys have obviously just arrived on the ferry this morning, is that right? Good to be here, good to be here. Yeah. So is this your guys' first time? Oh, I was up a week ago after yeah. the first one from yeah. Christchurch. Yeah. Beautiful. So you've all come from Christchurch? Yeah. There's yeah, a group yeah. of four of you, is that right? Oh, there's three and there's a friend. There's three and a friend. Yeah. Beautiful. So how long are you staying? We bought a one-way ticket, so we'll see, uh, ah, see what's yes. happening. Brilliant. And what made you guys come back, come back down? What? <laughs> We've got to Why? save our country. We have got to save our country. It's yes, not we here, do. You know. Yeah. They're treating us like serfs, like peasants, mm. yeah. and they're not representing, they're ruling. Yeah. And it's not good enough. 100%. The whole country is starting to see that. So um, we may not have another chance at this, because these guys that were up against Sorry, I'm a little bit hard of hearing, <laughs> but I'm, I'm, I'm liking saying, the fact that I'm I can saying live Now's the time for New Zealand to stand up yeah. and, and regain freedom and throw off tyranny. We've got to do it. Beautiful. Yeah. So are you guys, um, you're obviously going to set up a tent, is that yeah, right? Yeah, yeah. Got yep. a couple of tents. Out, out here somewhere or in Parliament We're grounds? We're not sure. We'll, we'll see. We'll yeah. see where we I can th find I think I've spot. got you just minutes after you've arrived, really. It yeah, looks yeah, like yeah. you guys are yeah, still yeah, looking yeah. around for a spot. Yeah. yeah. Oh, awesome. Well, welcome. You guys enjoy your time here. It's so cool to meet you guys. Yeah, so and um, thank, thank you for the chat. And thanks for what you're doing. <laughs> you're so welcome, yeah, my friend. Yeah, right. Cheers. Have a great day. Yeah. Okay. That's cool. Alright, let's turn the camera back around. Okay. So we were just heading down here to. Thank you. Welcome. Hi. Uh, just coming back around here to. We just sort of noticed a couple of a group of people who had obviously just arrived, so I thought we'd if we chat with them. over here. Charging station, what in a uh, over here. We've got all sorts. Uh, it looks like a dishwashing station. Got some cloths down there, some aloe vera. Uh, okay, so I think this is uh, boil water. So it's just got signs on it asking people to boil it before drinking. this is cool to see you guys we came down this end yesterday and uh, noticed that the police were actually in with the crowd <coughs> just chatting away with protesters which has been awesome there has definitely been a change in the vibes around here and the police have definitely been a bit more chatty which is so cool you can see they've got a little bit of a brazier going on over there uh, the brazier I can still see heat coming out of that so it must be still going but, um, yeah I'm just going to set up on the tripod again. Right. Okay. Hold on, Fana. I just need to get um, grab something out of my bag. I'm just going to have a quick drink. my health smoothie that I drink every single day. I blend it up every morning. It's got a whole lot of spinach, blueberries, strawberries, uh, slippery almond powder for my digestive issues, um, multivitamins, milk, um, yeah, all sorts of good things in there, just keeping my immunity up.
full hydrated again. Small police presence here. Uh, obviously we've got the van there now rather than the police car. The police car was blocking the way uh, for a while there, but uh, they obviously swapped that out with the police van the other day. Okay, to play. How's it going guys? <laughs> I'm Zeb, I am live streaming, I've got my camera facing down at the moment. <laughs> Camera's facing down. Any chance anyone want, can have a chat with me on camera? Oh that one, yeah, he looks really good. Well I'm just saying, I'm Oh, so funny. Yeah, suddenly, the purple, the purple, suddenly all these boys are very, very shy. <laughs> <laughs> it's about allowing, you know, the brother really to go. I have to allow my two account to take the I can't speak in That's all good. I've just got the camera facing down at the moment. Who set up this, um, who set oh, up the brazier? Oh, she's not coming with us for approval for my spirit. And he came back with a brazier. No, 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 no. And then we was having a fight. He was having a battle against the prophets of Baal. Hey, and then they said, who can like the fire? Hey, so someone who really was like a prophet came and um, said, he prayed in the Lord. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Read the words of the Bible. <laughs> Brilliant, you guys. Moses took him back in the record. I'll tell you the story. It's in the book. All good, brother. More interested in where the, the brazier come from. Oh, the brazier. <laughs> oh, that was from the fuck here down the roof. <laughs> <laughs> Should have said something. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, well, it's a, it's a nice addition. I'm, I'm surprised the um, little bit of Himana here haven't told you to get rid of it. What is the fire band status around here? Does anyone know? <laughs> it must be nothing because they haven't done anything. <laughs> <laughs> it must be nothing. Who knows? But yeah, so yeah. cool to see our Pirihimana in here chatting with the people, eh? Yeah. Uh, kapai, kapai, yeah. I got you. Yeah, no, awesome. Are you one Anyway, have a good day, guys. Oh, kapai, brother. I'm around every day. <laughs> Thank you. All right, so everything pretty peaceful up these ways. Everyone's sort of happy and a good mood, good morale. Looks like some um, friendly chats going on over there. So yeah, very cool, very cool. Alright, so we're just heading back towards Parliament now. Kilda! through here last there was a sign saying women this way and men the other way um, but yeah everyone can come in just help themselves I'll see if anyone's in this area no okay so here's the inside one of the shower areas I've got a shower curtain going across there I've got a towel hanging and uh, yeah here's our shower there's a caliphant there's a note there saying running cold. Uh, check that small has not turned gas off. Check that SML hasn't turned gas off. I'm not sure what that means, but anyway. There's um, a body wash there, gas bottle. Uh, again, anyone coming through who's possibly able to bring, bring through uh, um, full gas bottles, they would be very much appreciated by the people here. There are a lot of caliphons running the shower systems. No, right, bit of a bit of a maze to get out of here, so all good. Oh, you again! <laughs> Killed, eh? How's it going? Who set up these um, showers? You guys know? Nah, they've been here for a while now. Nah, very cool. Mm, yeah, yeah. Nah, looking 
really good. So there's another shower down that end. Just anyone can help themselves. Very cool. Oh, Cara, thank you so much. I'm, I'm glad I've got you here as a bit of a backup brain. Someone, SM1. So not small, someone. <laughs> uh, so here we have, it looks like a washing station. Just to do your dishes and things. We've got someone here just washing his cart. And as you can see, uh, the taps are plumbed in through the, the main water line down there. Yeah, where well, there's a will, there's a way, eh, guys? This is Happy Birthday Aiden. And, uh, it says, uh, thank you for incarnating into this precious human vessel. You are loved. Oh, very pretty. Uh, uh, your shops, your roads, in your way, WTF, about our lives, our jobs. Mm. Don't forget your history, know your destiny, and the abundance of something. The fool is who the cap fit. Let them wear it. Oh, sorry, the fool is thirsty. The fool is thirsty. Who the cap fit, let, it, let them wear it. Rise, ye mighty people, there is work to be done. Hmm. Sign on the back of the van saying hugs are healthy. Uh, we've got the dairy here that's been, I believe, open throughout the protest. So despite being in the middle of a protester campground, this business has remained open, which has been really awesome. Um, I did go in there at one stage and ask to interview the owner. Uh, however, he wasn't too keen to appear on camera, and that's completely fine. No worries at all. As you know, the University of Wellington is closed, um, so students have been unable to attend their courses here. Uh, the university has been citing health and safety issues uh, for the students. Personally, I'm, I'm not seeing those issues. There have been a lot of students walking through camp, and I have, I, I'm sure maybe it has happened, but personally I haven't seen anyone being abused. That's I'm just reading your comment there about the court ruling on the New Zealand Police and the New Zealand Defence Force. Yes, uh, we are aware of that. Um, we had an announcement up on the main stage uh, which we we caught live and that was announced immediately after the court case was uh, finished. And the crowd went wild. It was amazing. It, it brought tears to our eyes. It was just the best thing to hear. And now a precedent has been set, and future court cases will be able to cite that court case. And hopefully there's a domino effect and all the mandates drop, but we'll see how it progresses. <laughs> so we spoke to this brother in the tinfoil hat yesterday. Kia ora, good to see you again. Oh, you're holding a sign that says yeah. I was right. Yes, beautiful. I'm right, I'm right yep. God. Yes, definitely. Yeah, Beautiful, no, brother. Kia ora. Awesome. All right, we'll head back to Parliament now. Just through this camp over here. We've had a rejig around here, haven't we? Things have changed, things have moved. 
<laughs> Personally, I missed the, the big Mexican wave that was going on. Were you guys here with that? No. Oh, it was so cool. They had a big gazebo over the top of the foot path. Oh, and yes. Yeah. Yes. It was awesome. Yeah, my so, <laughs> no, no, so I'm live streaming. Are you okay on camera? Yeah. 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 We were doing the old... Yeah, you were doing the Friday, cheers. Yeah. Every time people walked through the gazebo, it yeah. was so we were funny. All, uh, we never walked some walked into the gazebo, we'd all start cheering. It was like it was like a big Mexican wave. It was so cool. I think oh, I, when I walked through, I was like, "What's going on here, guys?" And you all were just like, "Oh, just you know, just see." And I walked through, and everyone went wild. It was so funny. I think I ran through like three or four times. I was so blown away. <laughs> Very cool. Keep up the good work, guys. artwork that's gone up on the side of the media cabin. Love. Uh, Fano phone charging station, Manaki yeah, Media. So um, there has been a generator and charging down here. Maybe they haven't set it up for the day just yet. Hey, they're not a pretty doggy. Hey, buddy. I'm going to say hello because I can. Hey, darling. How are you? You're a pretty boy, girl, aren't you? You're so cute, darling. Good to see you. <laughs> you have a good day. I wish I had a hand free to pet you. Across the road there is Parliament Grounds. Let me see how we're doing. Okay, so uh, we've been streaming for the last couple of hours uh, since about uh, half nine, quarter to ten this morning. So uh, I'm just going to leave it here, you guys. I'm going to have a break, have a coffee, have something to eat, and then we'll get back into it in about an hour. Okay.